Hello, here's Andy, and this is a video um, that shows my uh, Godot export manager. Um, it uses the Collada exporter from Juan Linetsky and um, is based on that. And we'll make the pro uh, process from getting the Blender models to the Godot engine much easier. So, what does it do? Um, it is um, located in the render uh, settings here. So, let's collapse this. And there is um, a panel that's called Godot Export Manager. Now we can create um, export groups and um, they will be exported into separate uh, Colada files. So let's say we want to export this guy here and um, the level itself or the ground and the lights. So we can select the character with the armature and just press uh, the plus sign here. This will create a new group. Let's call it creature, give it an output or export name, creature or small creature. Now let's define the export uh, file path. This will be uh, in my Godot project folder, resources, 3D models, accept. Okay. Now what do we want to export? We want to export the images, the animations, and we want to triangulate this. So that's it. Now let's uh, select the ground plane, create a new export group. Let's call it level, um, export name ground, and set the export path. This is the same as um, for, the, for the other one. So resource 3d models except okay um, we can create another one for the lights let's call it lights create uh, name lights file path andy codot resource 3d models except okay um, you see this is the folder here. Um, what we now have to do is just press uh, or save the blend file and that's it. So if we go now to the folder you see that the images are exported from the character. Um, the groups uh, are exported and we now can go to Godot and just say import the files and that's it. Oh, okay, you see um, we have no texture for the ground and this is simply because I haven't set it here. So let's select the level and say copy images. I'll just save it, um, go back to Godot and re import the files and bam, everything is set up. So, um, you can disable the single groups here. Let's say you don't want to export these two. Um, save it. And now you see that only the creature has been exported. Um, you can also uh, disable the export on save and just export a single uh, group by just selecting it and press export selected group. You can add new objects um, to the groups by just selecting them and selecting the group you want to um, add new objects and then just say add selected objects to group or delete the ob objects from that group. So that's it. Now let's try it out. If, uh, if Let's say we change something here. Um, so uh, let's say export selected group go to Godot Oops. and say update Bam. and you have the updated mesh here so pretty simple very fast and it works very good I think so thanks for watching and um, I think this add-on will be included to Godot I will see what Juan Lenetsky says to it and if he likes it it will be added I think Okay, goodbye.